I don't know. Don't feel bad if you want to leave. That's so long. <laughs> Does anybody want to do that? Yeah! Let me, uh, let me, uh, you can see, see, fuck it. All right. What do we got? Let's just do it. We gotta do it rap. We gotta do it fast. Right here. Uh, yeah, you. Yeah, uh, I read an interview with you in 2004. You said you might do a follow up with Jurassic Park. Uh. Well, that no, that's not going to happen. Okay. I'm not going to do that. The only thing that I'm ever going to do like this again is the last Harry Potter movie. <laughs> I'm going to sing exactly situations. I'm just going to do it all by myself. Just two weeks cap. Just do it and then just put it out. Thank you. Yeah, what that's all. Thank you. What's up with the Civil War comedy? Oh, you. Oh, you. <laughs> Don't. Oh, I was having such a good time. <laughs> You think Civil War comedy? No, Civil War not comedy. <laughs> it's just not so funny. Uh, it's, uh, it's been a long time trying to make it funny, and every time I did, I just got uh, a worse and worse human being. So. <laughs> I just feel weird about it. You? I worked on that show as a consultant writer uh, here and there, very minimal not doing it right now. Uh, yeah, it was awesome. It was very, very funny. Question. Something else. Yeah. Question. Way back here. Yeah, let's do it. When you were timing it, like, did you write it out after watching the movie and, like, time each gag? Or did you write it out? Because even when you write it, you start things that are unrelated and then end on the joke. And I was wondering how you did that. Ooh. <laughs> Uh, I did one pass that was totally just like balls out, like, you know, I've seen this movie twice, I'm going to do one pass and make notes. Or uh, actually, I, did, I wasn't writing, I just had a mic and watched it, and I wrote, you know, I did whatever came. A lot of it sucked. Uh, and then I did another, like, two passes where I just revised it, like, chapter by chapter. So I don't know how to answer that, that just came out of, like, those passes. It's awesome. What up? Yes? Do you need all six beers to get through? Uh, well, after a while, it becomes just slaking the thirst. Uh, you know, you get a little hoarse, and then, unfortunately, the uh, helper is a herder, too. But I'm on, this is six, right here. Right. So, Let's go crazy. Someone just yeah. There's going to be more baby cakes videos. Yeah, well, uh, yes. Uh, we'll try to make that happen right now, for sure. Uh, yeah. 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 Yes. Any more details about that? Huh? Any more details about that? Well, you know, uh, I'm in LA and I'm talking, doing TV. It's TV and trying TV, and TV is so hard. Fuck. <laughs> so baby Cakes is trying to bust out of that TV wound. So, what else? Yes. Oh man, who didn't? I mean, growing up, hearing all of that kind of music, just dudes who were fucking so psyched about themselves. <laughs> like Huey Lewis and uh, the Crude. And they just thought, I'm, I don't, it doesn't, shut up. There's no editor, and I'm just gonna tell this world it's hip to be square. And, Living in a little pink house, and I'm gonna fucking. I don't shut up, I don't have teeth, it doesn't matter. I'm a singer, I'm an ugly 40 year old, I'm a pop star. Next. <laughs> we'll do two more questions. I don't want to do this too long. But, uh, Are you gonna do an Obama version of the George Washington? Absolutely not. <laughs> who, who inspired baby cakes? Um, well, humanity won. <laughs> And then this little girl that was a temp help at a toy store that I was working at. And <laughs> she was this fucking, so awesome. 
she was awesome, man. And she was just this girl from Philadelphia, and she was like, why are you gonna be so salty, Bradley? <laughs> This, I just, it was so intoxicating. And then one day she was like, I'm going back to Philly. I hate this fucking state. Texas, you suck it, Brad Neely. <laughs> this is how we should do this. We should do only, like, is it, we should only do questions for the credit duration, duration, so if there's any more, and then we'll quit it as soon as there's no more of this. Is there any more? Do you no need more? an assistant? What's that? Do you need an assistant? Oh, man, are you free? <laughs> are you free and... We're all free! Uh, forget it, for the next one. <laughs> Let's do it fast, come on. J.K. Rowling ever see this? I, I hope, I hope that she watches it in her satin sheets at night. <laughs> You know, like uh, like Superman and uh, Lois at Niagara Falls, or uh, you know. Just, just... Next, question, quick. There's a books and audio version of your version of this movie. Who would narrate it? That's awesome. I love it when it goes back around. I want to find the. Uh, novelization of a movie that was from a book, you know, like the novelization of The Road. That's <laughs> what I'm looking for, you know, when they're just describing what some dude was like. And so Vigo is like, uh, you know, hey, oh no, no, don't do that, little kid. And the kid's like, Or no, uh, I mean the Curly's way. Curly is way. Yeah. I can't see it. I can't rule. <laughs> yeah, he rules in that man. What else? Quick, come on. Why is Alan Rickman a woman? Why is uh, he looks like every fucking Depeche Mode fan I've ever met. <laughs> My wife didn't let me on him. Uh, Next! Why Ronnie the Bear? Uh, come on! Why not? It's obvious, man. Those two dudes are gonna fucking rule the school, and Ronnie the Bear just seemed like... I know why. Because his, his name is Weasel, and he is so much more than that. <laughs>